On November 28, 2024, India marked a significant milestone in its defense capabilities with a successful test of the CAB-4 nuclear-capable submarine-launched ballistic missile, SLBM, from the INS Aragat. The test, which took place in the Bay of Bengal near Visakhapatnam, is a major step forward in India's strategic defense and its ability to project power through sea-based deterrence. The CAVE-4 missile is a solid-fueled ballistic missile with an impressive strike range of 3,500 kilometers. It was launched from the INS Aragat, a nuclear-powered submarine commissioned into service in August 2024. This test marks the first time the CAVE-4 missile has been launched from a ballistic missile submarine, making it a critical achievement for India's defense strategy. Prior to this, the K-4 had been tested from submersible pontoons, and the successful launch from an operational submarine is an essential step toward ensuring its readiness for deployment. The INS Aragat is India's second nuclear-powered submarine capable of launching ballistic missiles, following the INS Arihant, which has been in service since 2016. The successful test of the K-4 from the Aragat strengthens India's strategic strike nuclear submarine, SSBN fleet, further enhancing the nation's sea-based nuclear deterrent. With a range of 3,500 kilometers, the CABE-4 represents a significant upgrade over the CABE-15 missiles deployed on the INS Arihant, which have a range of 750 kilometers. The Aragat is capable of carrying up to 4 K-4 missiles, significantly expanding India's strike range and its ability to target adversary territories from deep within the ocean, making it harder to detect and neutralize. The successful test is part of India's ongoing efforts to modernize its strategic nuclear forces. The country is also preparing to commission its third SSBN, the INS Aridaman, a larger and more advanced 7,000-ton submarine expected to be inducted in early 2025. This expansion reflects India's commitment to maintaining a continuous at-sea deterrence, a cornerstone of its nuclear triad, which consists of land, air, and sea-based nuclear weapons. India's growing capabilities in submarine-launched nuclear missiles are seen as a direct response to the evolving security environment in the Indo-Pacific region. With regional tensions rising and the strategic significance of the Indo-Pacific increasing, India's ability to deploy nuclear weapons from submarines gives the country a strategic advantage. These submarines, equipped with long-range nuclear missiles like the K-4, ensure that India retains a credible second-strike capability, even in the face of a first-strike attack. The successful test of the K-4 missile, coupled with the expansion of India's SSBN fleet, strengthens the nation's position in global strategic defense. As India continues to modernize its nuclear arsenal and expand its maritime capabilities, its strategic deterrence remains a critical component of its defense posture. With the deployment of advanced missile systems from highly survivable submarines like the INS Aragat, India is poised to maintain a strong and secure deterrent against emerging regional threats. This latest milestone underscores India's resolve to enhance its defense capabilities and safeguard its national security interests.